During, um, during World War II and in the years that followed the end of the war, some of the world's greatest thinkers, artists, musicians, scientists, fled, fled Europe and came to the United States. Many of them fled Germany. One of them, of course, we all know is Albert Einstein, clearly one of the greatest thinkers of all time. But there was another man whose name probably is not as famous as Einstein's, but whose work is equally important. His name was Werner von Braun. It's interesting about von Braun. He worked for Hitler during the Nazi regime. Brilliant man. And his work was with rocket technology. Well, he came to the United States, and he is probably more than any other person responsible for putting America on the moon. I think that it's clear to say clearly that Werner von Braun is the father of rocket technology. Before his death, and probably the reason he came to the United States, is because of a moving testimony concerning life after death. This is what he said, Werner von Braun. I think science has a real surprise for unbelievers because nothing in nature, not even the tiniest particle, can disappear without a trace. Nature does not know extinction. All it knows is transformation. What a testament to faith. And what a testament to Easter. Life eternal, transformation, eternity. This life that we're living now, I guess you could say, according to Werner von Braun, is nothing more than the launching pad. The Gospel says today, everyone who looks upon the Son and believes in him has eternal life. 